I wrote uh, some operating system like I wrote in resume operating system okay that I know it but at that time I didn't revise the topic from last 3 to 4 months I didn't revise operating system and currently I'm working in Nagaro as a software developer Hi and welcome back to Coding Ninjas guys. I am Kabir Singh and I'm here with another spectacular interview experience for you guys. So today we have Pankaj and we're going to talk to him about the company Farai Technology. So let's finally get into the interview experience. Let's see how many rounds were there for his interview, what all was asked in the interview and we're going to brief out every round for you as we do in every interview experience. So let's quickly get into the interview experience now. So hi Pankaj, how are you doing? Yeah. Hi sir. Yeah, I'm doing great. Thank you. Okay. Pankaj, can you give me a small yeah, introduction? Yeah, I'm Pankaj Kumar. I'm born and brought up in Jaipur and I did my graduation from NIT Jalandhar. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And currently I'm working in Nagaro as a software developer. That's great. Okay. So Pankaj, when you were sitting for the interview experience at Farai, what were the amount of rounds that were there? Like how many amount of rounds were there in total? Okay. Like there were one coding test, uh -huh. first round was coding test and there, after that uh, I had one technical interview. Okay. And after that technical plus HR interview, like third interview was technical. Technical plus HR interview. Okay. So I can say that three rounds. There were three, three rounds. rounds. Okay. okay, that's great. Yeah, yeah. So can you brief us out about the first round? What actually happened in that? What all was asked and how many questions were there? What was the duration and all of that? Yeah, okay, like it was uh, two hours of coding test. And okay. I had three questions, three okay. coding problems. Okay. Two problems were medium level and one problem was hard level. Like okay. So how much time did you take to solve it out of two hours, or did you take the entire like, two hours? Yeah, I took uh, entire two hours, and okay. I solved two and a half questions, like uh, some part of some like five test cases from the third one, like hard one questions. Like okay, so you solved two complete yeah. questions and one uh, yeah, partially uh, was solved. Partially, yeah. yeah. Sure. So if you talk about the entire difficulty of the round, you said two were medium, one was hard. So what was the entire mm -hmm. difficulty level? Can you rate it to medium, hard or medium, hard? What? Yeah, I would rate it to medium. Like okay, it was medium. Mm -hmm. Medium. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Moving on to the second round, what actually happened in that? Yeah, I had uh, one technical round. Okay. It was lasted uh, for one hour, uh -huh. one hour, I think. Yeah. Okay. So he asked me some DSA problems, mm -hmm. DSA coding problems and some like test cases and some theoretical questions from operating system and DBMS, some mm -hmm. SQL queries. Okay. Like that. Okay. Yeah. So how much difficulty would you rate that to be? Yeah, I would rate it medium to hard. Like it was not that hard, but not also medium, medium to hard. You can, you can yeah, rate it somewhere medium. between medium and hard. Medium and hard, right, right. Correct. Okay. And uh, what was there in the last round? What actually happened in that? Yeah, in the last round, they asked me some coding problems first okay. and uh, some HR questions also, like the person who interviewed me was VP I guess VP okay. of the company okay so he asked me one coding problem and uh, some aptitude questions also okay and what would so, you rate the difficulty of that it was easy level like I would rate it easy okay and how long was that interview it was around 30 minutes Okay, 30 minutes. Yes. So talking yeah. about the entire three rounds, Pankaj, mm -hmm. can we date it to like a perfect difficulty level? Like, you know, complete three rounds. If you talk about what was the difficulty level of the interview? Like as a whole, if somebody wants to sit in a company medium. like Farai, so how yeah. was the difficulty? And the process was medium level. Like I would rate it medium mm -hmm. for the whole process was medium level. Okay. And uh, when you talk about this entire uh, three round interview, what was mm -hmm. that, you know, there might be some obstacles that came up. So were there any obstacles? Were there any problems that you faced, such as some topics that were asked, which you didn't know, or you would like to recommend that, okay, always study these topics for interviews, or these are the important topics out of DSA or something like that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like uh, I had one problem in the technical interview, uh -huh. like, I wrote uh, some operating system, like I wrote in resume operating system Okay. that I know it. But at that time, I didn't revise the topic from last three to four months. I didn't revise operating system. And he asked me about like, how would you rate the own operating system? Okay. By mistake, I said that I would rate 
six out of ten, and then he asked me some questions from operating system, uh-huh. and I didn't revise the topic, so I didn't answer that. Okay. So he said me that uh, you wrote in the resume, you said this thing like you rate it six out of ten, then why you why are not answering? You answer? Correct. Yeah, yeah. So actually, I submitted this resume by mistakely, like I didn't revise this topic, and that. So he was like understandable. He understood okay. this thing, and he sent me for the next round. Pretty understandable. Okay, that's great. And uh, I really thank you, Pankaj, for giving us such a brief interview experience about Farai Technologies. Also, guys, if you want to read this interview experience out, I'll put the link in the description below and the pinned comment. You can have a look at the you know article written by Pankaj himself, wherein he's also mentioned the questions that were asked to him and the entire interview process as an article for Coding Ninjas. So you can have a look at it and always you know come up and solve those problems as well on the platform called Code Studio by us. So I hope you liked the video. If you did, hit the like button and subscribe to Coding Ninjas. I'm going to see you in the next one. Happy coding, guys.